Nigerian Senate has wandered into the controversial contract with British firm Process and Industrial Development Limited, PNID. At a resumed plenary on Tuesday, the Senate summoned the Attorney General of the Federation and Minister of Justice, Abubakar Malami, and other relevant government agencies to appear before it to give details of the gas contract and the $9.6 billion penalty awarded against Nigeria. This resolution follows a motion raised by Senator Okpayemi Bamidele, representing Ekiti Central Senatorial District. Other lawmakers discussed the financial implication of the judgment on the Nigerian economy and resolved to intervene when they have all the facts. It's on the need to invite the Honorable Minister of Justice and Attorney General of the Federation and other relevant stakeholders to brief relevant committees of the Senate on the award of 9.6 billion US dollars against the federal government of Nigeria by a United Kingdom court in the matter of P and ID, again, Process and Industrial Development Limited versus Federal Republic of Nigeria. No federal government ministry, agency, corporation, or body shall give any guarantee, letter of comfort, or undertaking in case of any concessions agreement made pursuant to this act, except with the approval of the Federal Executive Council. It's the law of the land. So I, 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 I stand here to say that on the basis of these two acts of this, um, made by this National Assembly and ascended to by the Federal Government, which is in your operation, sir, I don't think, sir, that there's any need for us here to, 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 to overlook the contents of this, uh, of this motion and the issues involved. Based on the fact that it is our own national reserve that is being monitored. All of the potential defenses just articulated by my colleague from Akwa Ibom, those are very, very powerful defenses that ought to be available to the legal team representing this country. I'm not so sure, Mr. President, that it is the smartest way that uh, through on national TV uh, we make uh, uh, all of these potential defenses uh, available to everyone, including the other parties. This is a very sensitive issue. And what we're doing is, as a Senate or as a National Assembly, let us be briefed. Let us invite all interested parties just to let us at least be on the same page on this matter. So that going forward, we will know the direction the country is going on this issue.